I got $1,050 worth of glue items for $330. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Truly. I'm a Sydney content creator and today I'm doing a quick haul because yesterday night I got the deal of a century. So I'll show you so you can get this deal as well. So I went a little bit crazy. I literally got a cardboard box to put all these clothes in. But anyways, let's go through it. So I got this little woolen knit crop top that has it's like a sweater crop and it has a little collar like this and then there's a zipper here that zips up and down and it's got long sleeves and it is cropped as I mentioned. The back is pretty plain but oh my god guys, this feels like so soft. It feels like you're cuddling a sheep. Not that I've ever done that but I'm sure this is how it would feel. <laughs> but anyways, I got this from a brand called Beyond Her and the original price was 80 bucks. And I think I got this for $20. Next thing I got was this champion beanie. And as you can see, it has the champion logo at the front and it's got this woolen detail up the top. Um, as I mentioned, it's really cold in Sydney at the moment. So I think this would be helpful. And the original price for this was 40 bucks and I got it for $10, giving that e-girl vibe. And the next thing I got is this little hoodie and this is the hood part of it here. And it has a zipper, but the zipper doesn't go all the way down. It just stops at the top. So I think it's like a hoodie top. And as you can see, it has the Tommy Hilfiger logo right there. And it's like this teal color. And the back of it is my favorite part. It has a huge Tommy logo like this. And the embroidery is in this like nude gold color with white embroidery as well. And it has the Tommy logo on it. This is super, super cute. And the original price for this one was, I think, 70 bucks, and I got it for $30. This one is a little bit big for me, but, you know, I can't say no to a good sale. The next thing I got was these Tommy High Rise jeans, and they are mom jeans. And so you can see the color here is like a dark blue denim. It has cutouts here, and it also has cutouts on the knees another cut out there it's like this distress material it has a lighter shade of blue and this was a little bit long for me so i am quite short but it's okay i cuffed it and it still looked pretty good and these are the backs it has two pockets and you can see it has a actually embroidered tommy label on it and i got this in a size 24 on my waist, so I was lucky to find it. This was the last one in this size. And the original price was this was, get this, $200. And your girl got it for $50. I'm pretty happy with this one. Okay, the next bag. So, this is one of my favorite items that I got. And it is this puffer jacket. And if you can see the pattern on it, it's like this checkered plaid pattern and it's like brown and black and it goes throughout the whole jacket. This is so thick. The top has a Sherpa lining over here and inside it is also super well lined. She's thick. And you can see that the Sherpa lining actually continues along the sides of it. But yeah, the lining on the inside is also really thick. Super cute. It's actually cropped and it does have these drawstrings at the bottom. So you can actually pull the string, make it tighter or make it loose. But this is so thick and the quality, oh my God. And I thought this was one of the best buys that I got just because of the quality. And this is from the brand Beyond Her. And I got this for $50 and the original was 140
I actually also got one of the same jacket for my sister because the deal was so good. So if my sister's watching this, don't ever say I did nothing for you. This one is a bit controversial because I showed my partner and my sister and they were not a huge fan, but I don't know, I really liked it. So it's this pink Playboy shirt. This was actually in the men's section and so it says Playboy on it and it has this graphic print, it has these open lips and I think that is, what's that thing called? I'm having a complete mind blank. It has a lit up match on it. So I thought the print was super cool. And the length is like quite long. I got this in a size large. And the back is just plain pink. And I pretty much got this to wear as a t-shirt dress and it does work as a t-shirt dress for me. And I really like it. Let me know if you're a fan of this or not, but I think I could style this pretty well. The original price for this was $70 and I got it for $20. And I've seen these Playboy um, collaborations on sites like Misguided and the price is like so expensive and I always wanted one, but it's always been too expensive for me. So I thought this was a good opportunity. So I did mention that there was a men's section as well. Um, and you can also get a lot of great deals in the men's section. I did have a look in the men's section for clothes for myself. My partner also went with me and he got a Tommy bomber jacket, which looks bomb AF, no pun intended, but anyways, um, and it was worth $300 and he got it for 50 bucks and it looks luxe as fuck. Like, check it out guys and girls and everyone. So the next thing I got was these high-waisted shorts and they're in this white denim and this is the length of it it is a little bit long and i kind of wanted it like that and they do have two pockets at the front and this is the back of it it has two pockets on the bum little label over here which says nude lucy and i think it's super cute i was looking for shorts because Back in my whole days, I was wearing everything that was like super short. And now I don't always feel like showing so much off the bod off. So I thought this would be good because it's cute. It's a good size. Works for me. And the original price was 80 bucks, And I got this for $20. Next thing I actually got is a dress. And this is a dress. It's like this chocolate brown color. And it has these two adjustable straps at the front and it goes like this so it is curved at the body so it fits really well so it kind of goes into your waist and then goes out the length it does have a little mini split over here and the size is it's still above the knees but it's not a mini and over here you can see there's like a mesh material and this is for your arms and this is ruched along the arms and it's super super pretty so this is supposed to be like a double strapped situation that we got here and the quality of this is so thick and it's so good and it just sucks you right up so it's really figure hugging and you can see the stitching at the front there's two lines and I think this is what creates the shape to the dress and the back of it is pretty plain and simple dress at the back but I think the standout parts are the arms of it and I have so many dresses, I was like, do I really need this one? But I don't know, I really liked it, really liked the quality of it and the color, and I just couldn't let it go. It's from this brand that I haven't heard, it's called First Miss. I don't know if you guys can read this. Miss A? But anyways, so I got this in an extra, extra small, and this was super cute. There was actually a lot of this left in stock, and I got this in an extra, extra small, and it was originally a hundred dollars and i got this for 20 bucks i'm telling you guys like the quality of the stuff i got is insane and that reflects in the original price of these things so they're not like those sales that you find where they put stuff like hideous stuff on sale that nobody wants to buy um this is actually really good shit and it's for really good prices the next thing i got is this champion tee it's like cropped and it has little short arms. It's got a neckline like that. And if you can see in the middle of the top, it actually has the word champion 
embroidered in it in white embroidery. The back of it is pretty simple, nothing going on. On one of the arms, it does have another champion logo on it. Now I got this in a size large, that is not my size, but I thought I'd give it a go. This is the crop top, it's pretty cute. It's a pretty basic, simple crop top. And this is a size large, but I feel like it's just giving me not a super oversized fit and it's not too cropped. I think it's a good everyday fit and it will go with my new Tommy jeans that I bought. Okay, now time to take it off. <laughs> so if you guys do go to this sale, this is a good example of even if it's not in your size, just go to the change room and see how it fits. Half the clothes, it's like, honestly, I feel like if I even size up, it would still fit because it was so form fitting. And I think this was a good find as well. So the original price for this was um, 65 bucks and I got it for $20. Before I show you guys the next one, I have to tell you a story. So the change rooms there is not normal change rooms. So it's basically the sale is inside a warehouse and the change room section is giving them warehouse feels as well. It's basically like this one huge warehouse room and in the middle they've just set up some tables for you to throw your hangers and clothes onto and everyone basically just changes in the open. Obviously women in one section and then men get a different warehouse room on the other side. But yeah, so you just change there and yeah, and they did put like standing mirrors. They look like honestly like the $10 ones that you find in Ikea. But yeah, just keep that in mind. There is no proper like closed off change room. You have to change in front of other females. So if you're feeling uncomfortable showing your bod off and everything like that, that's just something to keep in mind. But everyone was chill, cool. They're doing their thing. Honestly, you're, once you see these deals, that's the only thing that'll be running through your mind even while you're changing. So this is the last piece and it is another knitwear item it's like this cotton knitwear material and you can see it has like a checker effect between chocolate brown and white and the same thing goes on the arms where it goes white all the way down to chocolate brown it is a tiny bit cuffed not too much and this is the back, they continue basically the same design. And the neckline is this rounded neckline. And the material of this is like 50% viscose and it has 3% of wool. I know that's not too much, but the fact it says wool on there, I felt pretty bougie about that. But anyways, it was originally 80 bucks and I got this one for $30. I'll try it on for y'all. So this is another piece that my sister and my partner wasn't too sure about but guys i actually think it's super cute so it actually does fold down lower but i don't know the white way it falls it just kind of goes up and like sits like this so it works for me it's pretty cropped super cute you can see what it looks like from the front and it's exactly the same at the back and it just feels so warm and i think this neutral color aesthetic is super cute for the autumn time anyways so i've torn off the tag but anyways i'm not going to return it so i don't know did i mention the price if i didn't this was 80 dollars, and i got it for 30. It is the end of my glue store haul now is the time to tell you guys how i got nearly 700 dollars off in clothing this is glue warehouse sale going on in alexandria where accessories bags are for ten dollars and i think shirts are all for 20 for men's and women's by the way it's all the same price jackets anything yeah jackets coats those type of things are for fifty dollars denim jeans and jeans in general are for fifty and dresses are twenty dollars and shorts are twenty bucks as well these are massive discounts that i'm talking about and it is running from this from today all the way till sunday i'll put in the dates in the description box um, and i'll also put the link because you need to register and get tickets for it so i'll put in the link down the bottom in case you guys want to go don't worry if you watch this video and it's already um and the sales are already gone 
Don't be cursing me. Don't be sending some bad vibes because I'm pretty sure it happens every single year because I had a look online and they did have one in 2020, obviously before COVID. So I'm pretty sure this is a yearly thing, but just keep an eye out for it. But anyways, happy shopping. If you guys do end up buying anything, let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Toothpick? No. It's a match. Oh my God, totally. Let me see the price. I made it harder for myself now. Ugh. Oh shit, I just tore it off. Let me try saying it in a French way. First, Mise. No, I'm pretty sure that sounded pathetic. I've been thinking about crossing the line and just giving.